Hello guys and gals, and welcome to one of how to smartphones review videos of the soup case unicorn beetle pro series case for the Samsung Galaxy Note 9 and before I get started I'd like to take a quick second and giving a big shout out a big thank you to soup case for giving me this opportunity to review their case so much appreciated thank you guys and for all of you wonderful viewers if you guys would like to check out this case there will be a link in the description below and just gonna go ahead and start off by taking a look at the box, uh, the packaging, just a little bit of basic, simple package, cardboard box with the soup case, the branding up top, Unicorn Beetle Pro, and it's got a little authentication sticker just, authentic just to authenticate that this is actually indeed their case. And then the, there's a military mill drop test spec there. As we take a look at the back, uh, once again, there's a cutout here showing the soup case, um, the branding there, and then down here, there's just five features uh, that we will get further into uh, this video. So let's go ahead, open this up, take a look at everything we have inside. Get rid of any unnecessary, unneeded packaging. So as you guys were able to see, this is a three-piece um, case set. Um, there are three, the three pieces. There is the main portion, the main case. There is a pocket or a little... Uh, clip that goes with it and then there is a screen protector um, this is the black case that I did receive they do come in a black a blue a pink and a white and depending on the color that will um, feature into factor into the price so they, they range anywhere from about 19 to 23 dollars 24 dollars um, in that range so if you guys would like to check those out I will have that link in the description below so just take a quick look here at the first part the main portion of the case it is made up of a hard plastic um, and then on the outside it's like a soft uh, rubber or a hard uh, silicone type of material very absorbent in case something were to drop or fall it will absorb any kind of impact so that's pretty nice um, the hard plastic here in the middle um, we'll move on to the little uh, clip here also this thing is made out of entirely out of plastic few little metal components but mostly um, just hard plastic and it does have the clip here which rotates just so you can go ahead and um, set it to whatever is most comfortable most desirable for you and then the third portion of this case is a screen protector so uh, not every phone case comes with a screen protector this is one that kind of builds in uh, with the case itself so the first thing we're going to want to do is go ahead and remove any kind of plastics any kind of uh, wraps that we're not going to be using and I'm going to go ahead and install this screen first make sure to clean your surface of your device um, just to make it a little bit easier I will install the side with the most buttons first the volume up down and then the big speed button and then the power buttons on this side just go ahead press firmly and it will pop into place once again make sure everything is cleaned out and out of the way anything that you don't want in there uh, you're going to want to get rid of so the next part that we're going to do is going to go ahead and install the back portion of this case. I'm going to go ahead and start with the bottom. Once again, it does have the most um, little buttons, ridges, everything like that. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start with this side first. And I will go ahead and get that into place. Once that is in there, I'm going to go ahead and lower everything down. And I'm going to be pushing forward and pressing down simultaneously. And with the back hand, I'm sliding the rest of that case um, forward. Just like that, it should click right into place. And then just go ahead and come around the outsides and bring everything um, forward, get everything into place. And then if you have any kind of big um, gaps like we have here, what you're gonna wanna do is go ahead and just press firmly and get those in to make a nice solid line. And just like that, the phone case is now installed and you can also use it with the clip that it comes with. So just like that, it um, clips into place. Once again, this rotates for anything else that you would like it to do. So this um, three-piece um, three piece case is a full 360, protects your phone everywhere, the front, the back, sides, everything like that. So let's go ahead and start with the side. There is a volume up, down. The volume buttons do click. They do stick out ever so slightly past the edge of the phone, which is nice just to find those buttons. And then there's a little gap in separation for the Bixby button, so they do feel different, uh, just because one feels the volume up and down buttons feel longer, and then the Bixby button um, feels, you know, just a single short little button there. As you guys can see, there are built-up corners um, over here in the top and the bottom, just in case anything, if it were to drop out of your hand, um, gives it that extra bit of protection, just absorb some of that impact. And then down here on the side, you guys can see there is a little bit of uh, 
design there just to kind of give you like a little bit of a grip feel. As we take a look at the bottom, we will see there are openings for your headphone jack, opening for your charger. There is a opening for the microphone and the speaker down here. And then for the pen, there's also an opening nice and cut down low so you can get to it nice and easy. And then as we take a look at the next side, there is some branding, some suitcase there. And then once again, same type of texture we saw on the other side for a little bit of uh, better grip. And then there's also a power button with that same type of design, give you that grip. And then it also sticks out past the edge of the phone to give it nice uh, and easy to find. As we take a look at the button at the top, there's a little opening here for one of the sensors. Taking a look at the back of this phone, one of the features is a it does have the little kickstand. You can go ahead and set up your device whichever way you'd like um, for setting stuff up. So there you guys have it. Those are those, but it does stand um, both ways up, standing up and laying down sideways. Um, so kickstand in both directions. And then it also has that opening here for your cameras, sensors, fingerprint, scanner, all the good stuff. And, it, and they are beveled, so it will do more of like an anti-glare type of feature there, um, which is also nice. It does have the six pads, so if you were to set your device down flat, um, it slides on those pads. And then taking a look at the front side, once again, we have our screen protector all the way over. We got the openings here for cameras and sensors and the speakers, those sorts of things. And then as far as we can see, there is a little raised edge, so you're not scratching your screen protector. It does sit on like the the head and the chin over here so it gives you that little bit of a buffer so overall you know i'd say this is pretty cool with the three 360 degree protection all the way around um, uh, with the built-in screen protector you know and if you don't like that that's also always a feature you can go ahead and remove and take out that's not uh, too difficult to take out um, the kickstand feature is always a plus for if you're watching videos just set it down with a bigger device like the note 9 you can just set it up watch videos um, just kind of ease makes it a little bit easier to use um, the clip also a nice feature definitely a big phone hard to fit into your pocket you know kind of a big bigger bulkier case fits right nice with that clip go ahead and just clip it on there and makes it nice and easy to use and get around with and then this is this case is compatible with a wireless charger so you're able to get a wireless charger to work on um, this case you know i'd mentioned before is pretty strong pretty beefy it does pass a military 20 foot drop a military spec for a drop test on a phone case so it passes that so pretty awesome overall great you know i'd say strong durable case uh give this thing a thumbs up if anyone's looking for a you know heavy durable heavy duty case this is something that i would definitely recommend so if you guys would like to check it out once again i will have that link in the description below and that's all i got for you guys in this one thank you guys for watching have a nice day